All right, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be watching The Boys Season 1, Episode 3. In the last episode, <sighs> Huey fucking did it, man. Huey fucking did it. He killed Translucent. He actually blew his ass up. I did not think he would, he would do it. I thought he was bluffing, but, you know, just his entire life, he, he feels like no one's taking me seriously. Fuck it, I'm gonna do it. Boom, blew his ass up. After he set him free, you know, he's like, you know what? Fuck this guy. He just blew his ass up. <laughs> so good for Huey, man. Good for Huey. I'm kind of starting to think that all the superhero shit, it's all fake. It's all just set up to make them look as good as possible to maximize how much they can monetize and market them. So, <laughs> and then like Starlight, she actually stopped a real crime but it got taken out of context because the girl she was saving ran away and so it just looks like she's beating it just looked like she was beating up two dudes for like no reason and she was in civilian clothes so it blew her identity too and so her publicist went fucking off on her for that so i guess we'll see the repercussions of that she kept asking am i fired am i off the team and they never answered so probably not but she's gonna go through all this like all these fucking classes you know <sighs> kind of like when i got a copyright strike on my channel youtube made me go through copyright school or whatever and i was like bro what the fuck is this click 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 you know it's gonna be like that so <laughs> i don't know if i should leave that in there i don't know and then we find out still well i think that's her name she wants to get some soups in the military and so she blackmailed the senator and so she can manipulate it and then she can have all the power because they were never going to sign off on that because they think if we send a superhero to another country to attack they're going to send a fucking nuke back which makes perfect sense like that's literally the only way they can retaliate if they don't have a superhero you know but obviously we don't want to get nuked but she's confident her superheroes will stop the nuke too so because like we have 200 anyways i'm gonna stop wasting time we're just gonna hop right into this episode of the boys if you want to watch the full length uncut reaction that will be available on patreon as well early access to the next two episodes will also be on patreon so let's get started i need to go home see my dad he called me all right french will go with you Frenchie, that's his name. Either he that. goes with you, or I'll break your legs. <laughs> Translucent ski need one burn, huh? Where are you gonna stash at home, then you can't find it? No. Yeah. But we can slow the cunt down a bit. There's literally nowhere you can put that word. They will not find it. If you throw it in the ocean, the deep will find it. She saw that video on YouTube, and she came forward to thank you. Oh, okay. This is so good for you, and it's so great for us, because it is a partnership, after all. <laughs> this is feminine strength. Goodbye, Yellow Brick Road. And hello, Starlight. Oh, it's a new con- Oh, it's a new sexual costume. That's extremely fucking revealing. What? Why not? It's beautiful. Seriously? It it's just- You're sexualizing her too much. It's not me. I designed a Homelander suit. Dude, Homelander's suit covers his entire fucking body, neck down. I have the right to choose how much of it I show. That is true. Mm -hmm. You do. You just won't be doing it in the seven. Unless. <sighs> this is fucked up. This is so corrupt. Tomorrow, A train versus Shockwave. The oh, they're actually. Oh, they're actually having this. Damn, it's posters of all the heroes too. Oh. Okay, yeah, no, he's realizing he fucking hates all the heroes. He wants nothing to do with any of them. Wait, now, you're scaring me, Hugh. I have never told you everything. I have never told you how much I hate sitting on that couch staring at the TV like we're already dead. Wow. How much I fucking hate pizza rolls. I love pizza rolls. When I was seven! Yeah, and then... Dude, my parents do the same shit. I am not seven. Shit, I like... When I was, like, fucking six or seven, they fucking still think I feel the same way, and I'm like, dude, stop! My father was a bipolar. 
One night when I was ten, he tried to smother me with a Hello Kitty duvet. Oh. Wow. That's tough. Relatable. It's him trying to be relatable. Now, didn't I tell you we take turns at the pong? Oslo. Yeah, ping pong. Sign-ups. Hey. Oh, hell no. <laughs> <laughs> he knows he's bad news. I and say how you're doing fine, and I'm going to lie and pretend like I'm happy to see you. <laughs> I'm a happy man now. Life is good. Monique is back. We're good. Yeah, he wants nothing to do with Butcher. Not to mention, I'm actually making progress with these boys. Yeah, so I can see. Yeah, they're fighting again. I'm a motherfucker with a heart. Yeah. Whereas you? No, I know her at all. You're just a motherfucker. Yeah. Because <laughs> we just dusted a soup. Bullshit. Yep. Are you bringing Frenchie back? Because I can't work with that motherfucker. Oh, uh, why not? Frenchie, no, I ain't seen him in years. Senator Calhoun. Alright, we got him. We got him. Stop. He's not crying. The bill needs to go. So the senator has approved it or whatever. He's corporate wants to sell the shit out of it. Yeah. Yep. Mr. Edgar wrote those personally. So if you want to go to 82 and take it up with him, be my guest. Who's Mr. Edgar? Edgar. <laughs> He fucking hates her, bro. He hates listening to her. It's just another truck on the street. It's Fredchy. Bang on time. <laughs> Hi, Huey. Uh, uh, kids, tell them it's water under the bridge. It wasn't my fault, huh? Who is Mallory? Yeah, who who is Mallory? What is their beef? Whose ringtone is that? His? Shit! It's his ringtone. Oh, I forgot to marinate the tilapia. I am so sorry, sweetheart. <laughs> From work, I stopped by DeLuca's, pick up two fat tenderloins, some portobello mushrooms, that oh peanut. Oh my god, that has to be so hard to talk to your wife or girlfriend in front of everyone. All right, sweetheart. Talk to her like that, too. You did not want to do that. Mother's Milk. That's a nickname? No, my mother actually named me Mother's Milk. Mother's Milk? Look, all I need is your IPv6 number. Every desktop, every... Mm. Even in the toilet? No, Frenchie, not in the toilet. Look, I just... No. It's inside. I mean, home service is my specialty. Okay. You can tap into every electronic device. Like, my fucking computer. And my phone. We're with Bryman Audio oh, Visual. Shit. We got the new router. I'm... This is, is Huey. Mm hmm That's a lot. Okay. Come on in. All right, sure. Oh, great photos. Yeah, that one really came together. Yeah, she Let me know if you guys need anything else. Yeah, I think she likes mother's milk. <laughs> That's why she let him in, because she's attracted to him. <laughs> oh, my God. Let's go. Yeah. Come on, focus, Siri. John Hancock. <laughs> oh fuck! Why did that scare me? Ah oh, fuck! Is A Chain gonna recognize? Oh, he he doesn't recognize him, but he was having. You want an autograph or something? He was having a moment. Uh... Haven't we met before? Oh no, you don't have to do that. Just keep going. Now it's sus. You're trying to get us killed? Yeah. You can't blow your cover. <laughs> Fighting all these fucking Russians for training. Because if people find out one of the seven is missing, they panic. Besides, oh. you can't fucking stand transitions. Hell, homeland. Yeah, you bet, pal. Oh, uh, they're in a oh, they're in a shootout right now. What you mean to say is, dude, they're so nonchalant about it. Yeah, it's too easy. Elevators. <laughs> this is close to a coronary. 
It's got blood like engine oil. And still well with that. You finna get heart disease? Arteries are clogged. But they snap their fingers and we jump. Why? Why do we do that? Because they sign our checks. Yeah, they're manipulated by all the money. Ah. Ah, yeah, he's... Ah. Oh. God damn it. He tried to grab his heart. Can you get me? I don't want... He missed? You know the drill. He shot at us first. Bro. Oh. Oh, they're staging it so fucking hard. God damn it. Shit's so fucking corrupt. It's a good boy. Oh, she's gonna suck his toes. Oh. Shockwave's a problem. What if I lose? You're not gonna- Dude, you're not gonna lose. If I don't win, I'm out. Really? Nobody wants the second fastest man in the seven. I was kind of fucked up. I'm pound V, where'd you put it? I'm under control, I'm good. You ran through a girl, baby. Yeah. So it was the drugs that made him do it. So that we could finally stand up there together tomorrow? Uh. In I mean, it was all cleared with Stillwell and everything. Performance enhancer. Steroids for soups? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever it was, he was chased on it when he murdered Robin. Yep. Makes him run faster, so that's why he wants it for the race tomorrow. What is that? Fucking Captain America's super soldier serum? Maybe it's because the Seven might just be a squad of manky ruined heads. No, they still have powers. It probably just enhances all their powers. <laughs> Okay, dude, they should... Okay, there's no way they, they're they gonna take a 100 meter race. They're so fast, they probably run it in like two seconds, you know? They gotta do like um like four laps around the track because that's probably equivalent to like a 100 meter race to them. I don't know, just lucky, I guess. I like that wire's kind of out in the open. Is, uh... In some ways... I don't feel bad. Just right in that moment, it felt kind of good. Yep. Super villain, guys. Super a villain. When I had the detonator in my hand, I felt like a. Felt powerful. Like felt powerful. The price, whatever it is. It's worth it. I'll pay it. It's worth it. He wants vengeance so bad. It's what we've waited for the showdown. These men are extreme. Oh, I want to see the stats. Rain is ready to leave the station. She feels like shit. I got this. That's what I'm talking about. That's yeah. right. That's what I want to hear. Alright. Is he gonna race in the thong? Up to seven. Starlight. Company five. Oh, she's wearing it. <laughs> A little dramatic. Look, with everything else being rigged, is this fucking... You fucking <laughs> This fucking uh, race has to be rigged in A-Train's favor. Unless, still will wants to replace a train with shockwave so she she doesn't care you really dress the part it's your old uniform but i'm saving up for the new one no don't get the new one <laughs> ah. hey starline show us your tit God. sweetie you know what save your money i like that one much yes wait they didn't get the photo damn dude starlight can't fucking handle the bullshit in this She's she's too genuine for this. We love it. I love it. Why do we have a breakout? Because Homelander seems like a nice guy, but he's probably hella toxic. That's why they broke up. Are you falling for someone else? I don't think I can handle it. Is that so? Jealous. Jealous boy. Together forever. Okay, well. Fucking attachment issues. Fuck. Oh no, he has his regular suit. Yeah, they met before. I have Annie. Just realized. Annie? 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 Oh, fuck. <laughs> fucking hell, Huey. You know stuff. <clears throat> Kinda. Dude, obviously, he's not gonna fucking bring them. Did them before, like this morning before he even got there. You seem so normal, you know? And now it's just... No, I'm a freak. No, no, not a... I mean, she doesn't cover her face, so if you knew her as a civilian, yeah, you're gonna recognize her. 
so like her identity being blown in the last episode it's kind of like well it doesn't cover her face anyway once you're behind the scenes it's it's fucked up oh <laughs> off record you meant this job oh they're gonna fall in love because they're both genuine people just walk away i mean you got nothing to prove she wants to genuinely save people she can't just walk away but yeah if it's not if it's gonna be like this then it's gonna be hard to stay you know yeah would you like my number <laughs> yes that's what i was asking okay do i call you or do i just commit a crime <laughs> probably committing a crime would get me to you quicker so yeah <laughs> Fuck. I'm good. I'm good. I'm fast, baby. Like I'll roll, you know? Bro, he take coke? <laughs> oh, just one lap? That's it? Oh. A train won by a lot. Holy shit. World record for A train. They say lightning doesn't strike twice. How long did it take him to run that entire lap? Like, what? One second? Huey? Uh, yeah. Got it. Good. Gonna use that to their advantage later. Eyeballing a vial of V like it's made of Snickers. What, you think she nicks on an A-Train stash? Yep. The world, and that's the A-Train, baby! <laughs> mm, she's loyal to him. Celebrating tonight. Any special girl? Uh, well, you know me. I'm always in the game, but I'm too fast to catch. I'm open to offers though later. Wow, that just hurt her so hard. I don't know if she's gonna take it or she's just gonna do something with it. Oh, she's taking it, Never mind. She's like heroin. She's gonna try and kill him or something. Oh my God. What are, how, many, how many plays is that? What was that, like 765? Wait, where did she even unrack that? Where'd she unrack that at? There's no rack. Whatever. And she told A Train that V's a slippery slope. Mm hmm. Oh, what the fuck? See the A Train? Oh, no, it's your landlord. Let's write the check. I don't bite. Unless you want me to. Ah, uh, yeah. Great. Okay, let's get the check. Yeah, he just wants the check. Huh? No. Yes. I mean, it's... She's trying to keep it professional, but... Oh, what the fuck? Oh, yeah. uh, uh, they're fuck... The... <sighs> oh, no. The role-playing. You're a filthy pig. Say it. You're a filthy pig. Oh, my God. <laughs> Okay, uh, I mean, this script's better than most scripts on the hub, so... Oh, is she gonna accidentally kill him? Oh. I can't breathe. All right, all right. Oh, he can't. Hang about, hang about, not so fast. Oh. <laughs> Holy fuck. Oh. Damn. Oh fuck, did she realize she just did that? Oh, poor guy. R.I.P. Alec. Yeah, she just realized. You didn't do anything wrong. He was dead already. There's not- you wouldn't have made it in time. Oh fuck. We're gonna help you sort out this little mess. I'm probably hella confused, like how the fuck do you know? This, this literally just happened. Gotta do. Just tell us everything you know about this. Uh, it was developed. It was developed in 1942 by the these Germans called Hydra. <laughs> oh wait, no, fuck, that's wrong. Fuck. It was developed by this one German in 1942. Forgot his name. First experiment was on a guy named Steve. A fucking porpoise found this at the bottom of the harbor. 
Oh, it's translucent's body. Oh, Jesus Christ. Is that translucent? Yeah. Still think we got nothing to worry about? How did they even get through his skin? They stuck a... What kind of a maniac? They stuck a thing up his ass. See, now Homeland is going to be pissed that Stillwell didn't do shit about finding translucent. And he wanted to so much, so long ago. Can't I see through? Zinc, Homelander. Correct. And what's the box made of? Deep? D Zinc. Yeah. Correct. Why did I take so long to answer? I'm so glad you asked. <laughs> the way he moved. Oh. Coming for you. They just declared war. Why did they write that on there? Okay. Well, that was The Boys Season 1, Episode 3. Alright, let's talk about it. Alright, so that was Episode 3 of The Boys. In the beginning, Starlight got a new costume that we're not too big fans of because it's not about sexualizing the hero. It's about saving people. And nope, it's a business. They need to sell as much as they possibly can. So... <sighs> They're just trying to make her look as appealing as possible to everyone or whatever. And it's just like, and you know, you know who I feel kind of bad for, honestly, I feel bad for Huey's dad because his dad just, you could tell like, like his dad is just trying his best. You know, he's a single father and you know, he still treats, kind of treats Huey like he's like seven, but like, as a parent, it gets hard not to see your kid as like, even when they're grown up, it's hard to, it's hard not to see them as like a little kid still, you know? And Huey's just sick of it. You know, he's sick of being doubted by his dad constantly. You know, I I hope his dad doesn't die. His dad has really good like intentions behind everything. Like he just wants to have his son be safe and not go th through this horrible trauma of losing your girlfriend like that. His dad's just trying his best, you know? It's like, ah, I feel okay and then we got introduced to a new character it's called mother's milk great name <laughs> great fucking name i like him so far seems like a pretty cool guy seems like he can relate to hugh huey the most out of everyone give him the best advice so far give him the real advice he needs to hear and yeah so they found out that the soups take this super serum or whatever 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 it actually is you know we're gonna find out in the next episode what it is but it basically like i don't think it gives them their powers i think it just enhances their powers by like times 10 like they already have the power it just makes it 10 times stronger but now they're gonna find out more about it and possibly i think they want to know about it so they can use it on themselves and then so they can take down the soups later on maybe kiwi's villain origin story is coming along guys it's happening i'm telling you it's happening and then at the end right there they found Translucent's body, right? And I feel like Homelander is actually gonna is actually really fucking pissed now at Stillwell because he is a bit he was constantly just like, dude, let me go, let me go and find him. I can find him. Let me take let me put this in my own hands. And she's like, no, 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 my guys are on it, my guys are on it. Let's keep this corporate, whatever. And it's just like, dude, what the fuck? Like, that just pissed him off hella bad because he probably could have found him and saved him. But nope, because of her, he fucking died. So, I feel like he fucking hates Stillwell, you know, because she's just, she's bossing him around so fucking hard. And he's like, I am my own person, you know? Like, he doesn't like being told what to do and being run, like, by corporate. Kind of how, like, Starlight doesn't like it either. But he's more, he's deeper in the game than she is, so, like, he's whatever. But, yeah, that was Season 1, Episode 3. Comment down below what you thought about this episode. And if you liked the video, like the video. And thanks for watching.